Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 44 of Grand Ages Medieval, and I allowed... I, I wasn't planning to consciously allow the weeks, weeks to go by. The problem was that when I was... Uh, when I was... Uh, updating all of these uh, towns I did not realize that uh, I had the speed at what is this I had a speed at oh that's a campfire hmm I think the campfire is nothing okay what we can do is do a quick save So when I was going over each town and trying to see whether they need updating or not, I did not realize yet that uh, the speed was at... Uh... No, let's not do that. Uh, campfire is nothing. Was at We're 1. So that means time has been constantly moving. I didn't realize how how, how much time has, went, has gone by. Actually, uh, 6 months or 24 weeks had gone by. And so let us check uh, what happened to that period in terms of competition. We have 58 cities. Fra oh, Francois is now 21. Sergey Orlov is at 18. This guy, wow, this guy is very, very aggressive. He's now 22. He was 21 before. Francois was 20, 20. And so they have been increasing. How about on our side? Okay we are a little more aggressive and so anyway well i was trying to also position our traders so time just kept going and i didn't realize i should have anyway uh that doesn't matter uh that's why we were able to build up despite uh, updating all the towns we were still able to have uh two point over two million uh in gold pieces these towns I have not updated yet. Uh, okay. Oh. Okay. Uh, what? Uh, but we have positioned new towns here. So this one will be. Uh, this will be like food. This is our food basket. And I think this one. We will turn. Wait, wait. This one. It's easier to work with this one. Uh, we've got the P for these. Uh, how about we have three towns here? Let's use uh, P and O. Okay, let us let's name this town. Uh, this will this one will be our main industrial town. So let us name this Oak. A beautiful land. And it will be... That's our main industrial town. So it will be doing that. Steel. Pottery. Tools. And... Uh, pump. Or luxury. We we'll call it pump. Anyway. Uh, okay, so... One each. One each. One each. One each. Okay. And then... Now, deciding on these other two, we need to... Okay, so that will be our main food thing, right? This one will be our... Since it's right in the middle, will be our principal... What do you call this? Uh, principal... Production of bricks and wood. So what we can do there? Oh, okay. Let me. How about working with this by process of elimination? We can use this as the. This will be the textile company, a uh, textile town, <laughs> not textile company, textile town. Okay, let's. Okay, if that's a textile town, what? How about? And okay, starting with O O. Oleander.
Okay, that would be our textile town. And so, what we need to do would be... Skins, wool, textile... And, um... Garment. Oh, we only four. Oh, and wine. Yep, let's do wine. Okay, so now we have a textile town. We have a uh, hardcore city town here. This one we will name as... Wait, uh, hmm. how about another O? This is not technically a three, tree, but uh, it's a big... We consider it a big bush. Looks like a tree or sage. A beautiful land. <laughs> Okay, and it will be main, main, these will be its main components. And then, uh, hmm. I don't know what to do here. Uh, we can mine for, oh, we can mine for coal, metal, and then this will be again our main what do you call this uh, it will punch out settlers it will be our main settler producing town so okay uh now we need this guy to generate uh another trader Okay, with that town, oh, I forgot completely to check on uh, our road building, our engineering core. Okay, like this guy is now open, so we can have him build the, uh, the roads here. Uh, from here. Who here? A good choice. From here to here. From here to here. Looks good. I think it will be the same. From here to here should be the same. Yep. Ah, uh, because of all that uh, all that mountain in between. So that's fine. And since he is open way up here, let us see if he can start improving the roads up here. Right? Wow, look at all. Wow, there are a lot of roads that we can actually improve up here. Uh, hmm. Okay, uh, that one, that one, that one, major roads, major roads, Wow, this is gonna cost us a lot of cash. Can't be helped though. Oh. Uh, wow, that is a hundred twenty-four thousand right there. Okay. I think we had we had a road builder here too, right? I think we had a road builder. Yeah, that's right. Uh, okay, and then let's check on our road builder down here. Nope. Not that one. Oh, okay, he's way down here. Okay, um, uh, hmm. K, 
can he start developing the roads here the problem is that we might not have the uh, what you call this the resources for it in, uh, in terms of bricks it requires a lot of bricks so uh maybe let's not do it for now and uh okay uh okay and so the other we have another two this is the area where we have to decide what we want to do okay let's save that because we have already established those towns uh, let's save this these uh, and then uh, see what we want to do here this one would be see in this plain area it is a little harder there we really have to trade resources here so this would be I'm thinking this would produce clay a uh, coal pottery uh, salt clay pottery salt and bacon so that's four items and then uh, maybe this guy here about here so this guy here would be the one producing uh, wood a uh, brick uh, hmm. metal and then we need to import coal from this guy so once we produce metal we can convert that. so metal and tools right and then we leave one one slot open so that if uh, we we are actually producing tools then we also can import coal from from this one to give us uh, then we can make uh, make make no no we can import a uh, pottery from this one to make palm and over here oh I thought uh huh is this too close let's go maybe we should come down here I hope it's not too close how about over here yeah, hopefully, hopefully this one will allow on. us to uh, to get into a better position. And then this one, I'm trying to get to the uh, to these uh, to this winemaking here. So there should be winemaking over on. here, or maybe it should come over to this side. See, there's winemaking on this side. Let's go. Let's. How come there are it's not showing any area that we can actually see we cannot do that uh we're setting off this. see this is wine making country how come we are not being over here is no not no wine making how about here no it's still no wine making but this is showing this is showing grapes anyway let's uh, how about oh, moving man. over here oh now it's showing wine making this is this On is ridiculous way. right <laughs> okay okay that's good wow we are so far away uh so this one okay what we can do is no we need the salt we want the salt here so again this one will be doing coal pottery salt and bacon okay uh, okay here we will do M's uh, no we have s we have C up up uh, on top of us here maybe what we can do is when we set up the cities uh, we'll call them by how about mm,
Uh, okay, how about bees? So that's why uh, even the the positioning, the positioning of the uh, different towns, and how they will be supporting each other, uh, that is that takes so much time, aside oh, from just getting them there. Uh, okay, so this will be bristle cone, and then what will they be doing? Uh, they will be doing salt, coal, pottery and bacon so we can still leave uh wow uh we have not factored in uh we have not factored in uh food okay so this one will be doing what uh, okay because oh this is this one is too close. He cannot. He cannot. Wow. Ouch. We're too close to our own. Uh... Wow, we're too close. Yes. Uh, how about if we move it up here? Sounds a bit? good. Wow, it's got to be so far up. Okay. We're setting off. So this one will be doing, uh, hold on. So if, if we're doing this one, uh, wait, this will be our major main, uh, Okay, well let's call it, let's call it uh, by a different name. Let's call it beach. A beautiful. Okay, and then they will be producing the basic, our main basic, and then um, metal, right? Or shall we keep it open? Metal and. Uh, tools once we get uh stuff from from uh, once we get imported coal from the other side and then uh this one at the bottom wow it's too far away right it's quite a ways away uh see we want the wine component here this will be our main food base so we can produce uh grain wine alcohol and so that means this one if that's what it's going to produce we might have to produce honey so that uh this guy down here can make cake so this would be uh, grain alcohol uh beer uh wine and maybe cake okay wow he's so far down there that's why just to get to the wine it's it's so that's why the placement is a little hard how about here no so this is the best spot that we could get okay let us uh, set this up so we'll call it by <laughs> Since, since it's of, uh, it is uh, our wine production, we will call it Boojum Booze. Let's call it. It's 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 really the name of a tree. Uh, Boojum. I actually looked for it, and it is really the name of a tree. And here we have, we will do grain, wine, grain will go well with uh, beer, and then maybe we can do fruits, right? So one, two, three, four, 
or if they give us uh, honey, we can make cake also. That's right. All right, one, two. So if they, if we import honey from uh, bristle cone, then we will be able to buy uh, or make uh, make cake. So this guy has to come all the way here. On the wow. Way. And then let us have oh. We did not uh, authorize the. Then we need to send. Oh, we have to create the roads. By the way, uh, did we? Okay, make this. And we will make honey, right? Make honey here. And we can send it south. This guy, we're making this. Uh, we can start mining for metal, right? And then once we get the uh, coal, we can make tools. And with tools, we can then make a uh, pump. Okay. Here, this will be called uh, bristle cone. How about balsa? A beautiful land, and then it will be making. Fur. Okay, so how are we positioned? Oh, ouch. <laughs> okay, it doesn't look very, very interesting. Anyway, uh, doesn't look very efficient, I mean. Uh, because uh, they are, yeah, it would have been uh, well worth if it's like a pure, I don't think it doesn't matter how far away they are. Okay, let us make the connections here uh, from here to here. Looks good. How about uh, from here? To here? Looks good. How about from here to here? The scenic route. And then uh, from here to here? A good choice. And then from here to here? The scenic route. And then from here to here. Looks good. Wow. Okay. Uh, then we need to assign a. Uh, what do you call this? A trader for here. And he happens to be right here. <laughs> Okay, let us let him have this route. So from Wow, these two cities are pretty close. So from Let's just work on this city for now. One. No, 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 no. What am I doing? Uh, no, no.
I don't think he's the one uh, doing the uh, this circuit over here. Anyway, uh, let me figure this out. Uh, I'm kind of getting a little confused with so many cities uh, we're, since we're running so many cities. Okay, let me cut the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys for joining me. I hope you'll join me in the next episode. Bye!